Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do my whole collection for Japan update and to be honest I don't know what the update this is because I don't update regularly every month anymore. I don't know what's wrong. Next year I'm going to do it again. I will start fresh in January because I need, I need new products to work on. When I do it next year I'm going to be better at uploading every month because then I don't confuse myself because I am confused about my updates. I think it might be update 7 or something like that. I don't know. This update is exciting and I'm an oily mess because I didn't touch up after I got home. I got home for like a 20 minutes ago or something. I forgot. That's life. Real life, you know. This update is exciting. I have an empty, I have a pan to show you guys and I do have some progress. Let me just tell you the most exciting part first. It's done. I finished the white shadow that I have from Catrice. It is the single shadow called Eyes Wide Open. It is their absolute eye color singles. And yes, it was a white, but you don't need a lot of white eyeshadow when you only use it on your brow bone. So I'm really, really, really happy about this being done. That means we can roll another one in. And the other product that I'm going to roll out because I hit my goal and I hit pan on an eyeshadow. In my W7 Enchanted palette, I am really excited about it. Even though this palette is one of my newer palettes, I hit pan in Mystical like I was working on. This brown right here, it is a very standard brown, warm brown shadow. It was not really hard to use, it was just hard to remember to use this. So, two new products I can roll in and then I just have some small progress to show you guys. The item that I rolled in last time is my liquid lipstick from W7. It is the Skinny Living 2 and this is in Air Kiss. This is definitely not a fall shade, so I only used it once in the past month. But that is uh, more than three of the items in this project that I'm not going to talk about because I didn't use them. My eyeliner, my highlighter and the glitter didn't use them. So here we are. Use this once. Nine more times to go. Let's see if I can make it before the end of the year. I used this a few times. Is it is an eyeshadow from W7 as well, from a palette I used in my eyebrows. Last time I hit pan on it. I think it is expanded since. I don't know what I'm going to do with this yet because I actually use a warm tone brown in my brows right now. I will keep it in just to see if I can make some more progress on it before the end of the year. I have my Neil Shore eyeshadow. It is like a cream to powder eyeshadow. The dip is definitely bigger now. I use it a lot, not consistently, but I do use it a lot. So the dip is bigger. That was my goal to make a dip in it or to hit pan. I actually feel like I should try to hit pan on this by the end of the year. So that is my goal set. The last two items I'm going to talk about is lipsticks and they are both from W7. Obviously, the one that have been that have been in here all year is my metallic mattes uh, in Neptune. It is a red lipstick, and I have used it a little bit in the past month, so I could make a new line. The line is so so tiny, but it's there. That one right there is there. Use it a few times enough to make a line and I'm excited about that. The Naughty Nudes lipstick in Sunshine. This is how it is looking. I have used this a lot but apparently not enough um, to make really nice progress but I have used it and it is kind of consistent progress. That line right there, the bottom one, that is my goal. I have goal lines on all of my products but yeah that is the product where it is so I don't know if I can make it but if I finish up uh, the lipstick I am working on right now I'm trying to focus on it because I really want it gone before the end of the year if that is gone really soon I can start working on this uh, as an all time lipstick and then it can be done Felix, say hi I'm with you 
that is that are my products and then I'm going to choose two new products and I will be right back with those items. At least the plant is fake. So that's always something. So let me choose two products. 35 Stroke of Genius Oh, that's an eyebrow product Stop I don't know if that is going to match my hair though I'll, I'll, I'll go get it um, And then we have one more <laughs> 293 No way Jose. That is a W7 Glitter Pop uh, liquid lipstick and that is a glitter lipstick so no way I'm going to pan that. I'm, tr I'm, I'm considering decluttering those because I'm not going to use them. 283. Sure. <laughs> liquid lipstick. Why not? Let's see what color this is. It is called Marbella. So I'll be right back with those two products. I have the products. So let's see here. The W7 Stroke of Genius Brow Pencil in Brunette. I used it a few times before I dyed my hair. This is getting dry. Here. Maybe it matched me. I think it does. Then we have the W7 Velvet Secret in Marbella. It's a nude. Nice. Here it is. So that's a really warm tone nude, but I think it's going great with the orange that I'm working on. That was everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm really excited about the two new items that I can roll into this project and work on something new at least. I think it's really exciting. I'm, I'm, I'm excited. I feel lucky about this little lip color for this liquid lipstick. 10 uses. I think that is a... Uh, Fair now that I'm working on quite a lot and the brow pencil let me see how much there is maybe I can finish it let's see maybe I can I don't know let's see how it goes you will know uh, by next update and I think that might be either the finale or there will be maybe one more update before the finale I don't know let's see I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like. Subscribe down below. If you're new here, I would love for you to be part of this small family that I am growing here on YouTube. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And on to my next one. Please take care. Bye.